It seems to be a ritual that is gaining momentum among students day by day. Those feeling aggrieved by institutional systems airing out their frustrations by engaging in arson attacks, torching of dormitories and other physical amenities is now a trend in some Kenyan schools. <laughs> Embu High School in Embu County is the latest statistic. Students went on the rampage on Sunday night and started a fire to protest writing forthcoming mock examinations. Preliminary investigations revealed that during evening preps, a section of students assembled gas lamps around the institution before torching the school, a situation that caused a stampede. Nikakuta, moto tayari na waka kwa madaraja. Pia kwa ofisi zingine zimechomeka na watoto tayari wamekimbia wako nje ya shule kwa sasa confirming the incident embu west dcio joseph kipto says we form 4 and 2 form 3 students are in custody in connection with the incident we managed, we managed to get uh, five of them who are still around and uh, we are, we are going with them to interrogate them maybe we will, we will establish what caused the incident students claim inadequate food supply could also have contributed to the act <laughs> arson attacks were also reported at center Reza's bikeke girls in kitale itibo boys in kisi saint angelic girls in meru and twilight high school in kericho counties at least 16 schools have been taught in a span of less than a month. Education Cabinet Secretary Dr. Fred Matiangi is this week expected to appear before the Senate to explain measures undertaken to mitigate school unrest in the country. Linus Moshigadi for Channel 1 News.